Hi, this is Elvis Presley. I guess the first thing people want to know is why I can't stand still when I'm singing. Some people tap their feet, some people snap their fingers, and some people just sway back and forth. I just sort of do them all together, I guess. Singing rhythm and blues really knocks it out. I watch my audience and listen to them, and, and I know that we're all getting something out of our system, and none of us knows what it is. The important thing is that we're getting rid of it and nobody's getting hurt. I suppose you know I've uh, I've got a lot of cars. People have written about it in the papers and a lot of them asked to write and asked me why. Well, when I was driving a truck, every time a big shiny car drove by, it started me sort of daydreaming. I always felt that someday, somehow, something would happen to change everything for me and I'd daydream about how it would be. The first car I ever bought was the most beautiful car I've ever seen. It was second hand, but I parked it outside of my hotel the day I got it and sat up all night just looking at it. And the next day, well, the thing caught fire and burned up on the road. In a lot of the mail I get, people ask questions about the kind of things I do and all that sort of stuff. Well, I don't smoke and I don't drink and I love to go to movies. Maybe someday I'm going to have a home and a family of my own and I'm not going to budge from it. I, I was an only child, but uh, maybe my kids won't be. I suppose this kind of talk raises another question. Am I in love? No. <laughs> I thought I'd been in love, but I guess I wasn't. It just passed over. I guess I haven't met the girl yet, but I will, and I hope I won't be too long, because I get lonesome sometimes. I get lonesome right in the middle of a crowd, because I've got a feeling that, that with her, whoever she may be, I won't be lonesome no matter where I am. Well, thanks for letting me talk to you and sort of get things off of my chest. I want to thank all my loyal fans who have watched my performances and in that way became friends of mine. I sure appreciate your listening to my RCA Victor Records. I'd like to thank all the disc jockeys for playing them. Bye-bye.